So this morning I was working on the cargo condor and for some weird reason the motors went on full throttle and it cut me uh, pretty bad. Uh, so I had to go to the hospital and get 8 stitches. So this is the cargo condor. Uh, it's got ailerons, rudder, and differential thrust on the rudder. But I can turn that off and just have normal rudder and elevator and the bomb bay door. So made in flight. So right here, all the motors went to full throttle, just like they did when they cut me, and it took off on its by itself. Whoa! whoa. Fly it! Fly it! It, it took off on its own. <laughs> <laughs> it whoa! It just took off. So if anybody thinks they know why the motors are turning on like that, uh, just like on their own, I don't even touch the throttle stick, but if you think you know why they're doing that, uh, write it in the comments. <laughs> it flies. Why did it take off like that? Same thing that happened to my room. So luckily uh, the plane was really stable and it just took right off uh, really nicely and it flies awesome. I'm gonna try some differential thrust. Ready for this? Let's see what that'll do. That turns it really good. Turning with differential thrust. That's good. It's got the weight of a glider for the one area. So this thing is all made with uh, 6 and 9 millimeter Depron from RCFoam.com. Alright, now I'm going to do a flyby with the Bombay door open. And come around. It's wide open. Sounds cool. Nice. That was a good loop. I'll try to roll now. Cool. <laughs> All right, so while these clips are playing, I'll tell you a little bit more about the airplane. Uh, the wingspan is 70 inches, and the wing area is uh, 910 square inches, and the plane weighs four pounds. Six, that's 64 ounces. Uh, at half throttle, it's pulling 270 watts. As you can see, I had four motors. And at full throttle, it's pulling 375 watts. Uh, so the wing load is 10 ounces per square foot. And on this flight, I was using two 2200 milliamp three cell batteries. And throughout that whole flight, which wasn't that long, uh, it drew uh, 9, 978 milliamps from one battery. So 978 times two, it drew that many uh, milliamps in that flight. So 
I think it'll have a lot longer flight time because it has uh, 40, 4,400 milliamps total of battery stuff in it. Uh, so that's basically my cargo Condor's first flight, and I'll be flying it again later. So thanks for watching. Bye. Here's just some more aerial video. Hi, my name's Cut, and I can talk. Not really, though.